Treatment for Root Rot in Houseplants Hello to all plant lovers and green thumb friends. Today we're going to talk about one of the most common issues with houseplants root rot. In this video, we'll go over the causes, symptoms, and effective treatments for root rot. So, if your plants have been looking a bit dull or wilted lately, stay tuned until the end of this video. In many cases, we observe plants wilting without any clear reason, with leaves turning yellow, falling off, and growth slowing down significantly or stopping entirely. All these signs indicate that the plant's life is nearing its end and its roots are severely damaged. In such situations, without proper knowledge, people often try to save their plants by watering them more, but this is certainly not the solution. One of the main issues plants face, even for experienced gardeners, is root rot caused by overwatering. Unfortunately, root rot is hidden beneath the soil, making it difficult to notice and allowing it to go undetected for a long time. Causes of root rot in houseplants. Root rot is one of the most common issues in houseplants, typically resulting from overwatering, poor drainage, or unsuitable soil. When soil stays too wet, roots cannot breathe properly, creating an ideal environment for harmful fungi and bacteria to grow, which then cause the roots to rot. Preventing root rot. Even if an infected plant dies due to root rot, it's essential to take necessary steps to prevent this disease from spreading to other plants. Other plants and any new additions are also at risk of root rot throughout, throughout their lifespan. Here are some common plant care mistakes that often lead to root rot. Avoid overwatering plants always allow the soil to dry out completely before watering again. A few minutes after watering, check the saucer under the pot and empty it if it's filled with water. Avoid using heavy soil with poor drainage. Use root strengthening supplements. For plants prone to fungus and root rot, such as Ficus lyrata, Ficus elastica, and Schefflera, apply a fungicide monthly. Signs of root rot. Root rot in plants can be identified by several noticeable symptoms. One, when the plant begins to wilt and loses its usual vitality and freshness. Two, when the plant has yellowing leaves and the yellowing spreads quickly. Three, leaves turn brown, completely rot, and eventually die off. Four, another sign is halted growth with no new growth appearing on the plant. Five, in such cases, the plant's stem may become very soft and lose its usual firmness and strength. If you remove the roots from the soil, you'll notice they've turned brown and are very soft when touched. They easily fall apart. Healthy roots, in contrast, have a lighter color and a firm, dense texture. Treating Root Rot 1. To treat and slow down the spread of rot to healthy roots, quickly trim away the decayed, blackened, and soft roots. 2. Rinse all roots thoroughly under running water, then spray them with a fungicide. Three. Wash the pot with water and dish soap and apply fungicide inside or use a new pot. 4. Choose a dry, lightweight soil mix with high drainage and replant the plant in it. Preventing Root Rot To prevent root rot, be sure to pay attention to watering and allow the soil to dry out between waterings. Also, make sure the pot has enough drainage holes. I hope this video has been helpful and that you can keep your plants healthy and thriving. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. Until the next video, take care.